Welcome to Cooking with the Carmichols. I'm Megan Carmichael. I'm Finn Carmichael. And I'm Ollie Carmichael. We are here to make my mom's famous hash brown casserole. We have her handwritten recipe that she wrote out for me. Nana's. Yeah. Even though she passed away? She did. We, we did lose her um, about four years ago. And this is a very special recipe to our hearts because every time we make it, we think about her. So I have my helpers here. We <laughs> we have the, um, the oven preheating at 350. Yeah, we'll make it simple. This is a very simple recipe. Anybody can make it, and it is always a hit. First thing we're gonna do is take is there a our- Is there a, a secret ingredients? A secret Love from Nana, that's right. So, first thing we're gonna do is take our hash brown potatoes. Now, the very important, critical part of this <gasps> potatoes? recipe- Potatoes? Yes. Is that they are diced hash brown potatoes, not shredded, they have to be diced. That makes this recipe. And they've been thawing in the refrigerator, so they're all thawed out and ready to go. Would you like to pour these in? Yeah. All pour, them? pour all of them right in the bowl. But I want to try potato. I don't think <laughs> I don't think you want a cold, uncooked potato. Why are they? <laughs> what do you think? Yeah. <laughs> you like it? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay. So we have poured in our bag of hash brown potatoes. Next thing we're gonna do. Is yes, we're gonna take two cartons of eight ounce sour cream or one 16 ounce carton math, and we're gonna dump it in the whole can thing. I wave? Yeah, you can wave, you can do whatever you want. There you go, People ballerina all the olive. Are People all over the world are gonna be so into our hash brown casserole. Yeah, yucky to lick it. Uh, it's sour cream. I don't know. You want to try it? You can try it. Is it sour? Do you like it? You do? Yeah. Cool. I like sour any cream kind too. of potatoes. You do? Yeah. Even even raw, cold potatoes? Wait, I ate raw? Well, it's not cooked yet. Would you like to scoop this one in? Next thing we're going to do is we are going to add one can of cream of chicken soup. Okay, you can pour this in since you did the potatoes. Go ahead. It just looks like... You just pour it in there. The whole Kind of give it a shake. Here it goes! <laughs> Okay, so we've combined our potatoes, our soup, our sour cream, our onions, and our cheese. Now we're gonna get a spoon and we're gonna mix it all in. Now we're gonna add some salt and pepper into the bowl. You just add as, I don't have any exact amount, just add as much okay, as you like. Okay, I'll add it in. So now we're gonna give it one more mix. Nine by 13 baking dish, and we're gonna spray it. You wanna spray it with our coconut oil spray? No, no, you, don't, you do not wanna eat this. I love coconut No, but you don't wanna eat this. No, <laughs> we're not spraying it in the bowl. We're spraying it on here. Okay, let me show you. So you put your finger here, and you kind of press down. And no! Like that. You can do more. We gotta do the whole thing. There you go. Can I eat it? No, you 
cannot eat this. You're gonna take your mixture of potatoes oh, and oh, cheese yeah. and sour cream and cream of chicken soup and all the things that are so good for you. And you're gonna pour it into your baking dish and kind of spread it out evenly. Now, here's the fun part, guys. You're gonna take a sleeve and a half of Ritz crackers and you're going to put them in a large Ziploc bag. <clears throat> and eat one. <laughs> ben says, guys, eat one. You can eat one or two. They've eaten about seven while we've made this video. Now we're gonna take our rolling pin. Ready? And we're gonna go like this. And you're gonna just crush up um, the Ritz um, crackers. Um, <laughs> oh my gosh! Okay, you almost hit me in the head. Okay, let's have all of that turn. Good job. We've got our crushed Ritz crackers, and now we're just gonna take it, pour it over the top. <laughs> take your melted butter, and you can just why not add a little more deliciousness? I'm funny. Thanks, Why thanks. And there you have it. Hash brown casserole is ready to go in the oven at 350 and we are gonna bake for 45 minutes to an hour. So, here we go. We're gonna put it right here in the oven. That's so, it's all done. Out of the oven. Hello, there it is. Mm. Happy cooking. Happy eating.